All right. So in Excel, there is a function that you can use to calculate median, but there is no function that can help you to get a median using a condition. So here in this data, I have two columns. In the first column, I have day one and day two, and in the second column, I have few numbers. So what I want here, I want to calculate median only for the day one. So here I need to combine two functions, median and if. So median for calculating the median and if for the condition. So what I'll do, first of all, I'll enter the if function. And for the logical test, that is to identify the day one, I'll specify the range that is A1 to A12. And then I'll specify the condition to check day one and then I will specify the range B1 to B12 if the condition is true. So if in this range A1 to A12 any of the cells has this value only then I want to get value from this column. And now I will close the function without actually specifying the value if false because I don't need to get any value if the condition is false. And now in the end, I will wrap this function with the median function. And to get the result, I need to use control, shift and enter. And this is how you can calculate conditional median in Excel. So let me test it for you. So if I calculate median for only these six cells, these six values, it returns 90. So this is the same exact result that we have got here with the conditional median formula. Now let me quickly help you to understand this formula. So when you specify the if function and the condition inside it, it returns true for all the values where you have day one in the column A. You can see here we have true for all the values in the day one and false for all the values with day two. And in the end, the if function returns the array of values from the column B where we have numbers for the day one and false for the day two. And in the end, the median function calculates median using those values. So if you don't have values for the day two, it will only calculate median for the day one values.